Hello everyone, welcome to Building Web Apps with Spring 5 and V8 Gears by Pact. My name is Ankit and I'm DevOps nerd, a Spring and Cloud enthusiastic. In my spare time, I like to work on Docker and provide educational services. So let's see what we are going to cover in this course. This course is one-stop guide to build an end-to-end -end modern web application by integrating popular frameworks Spring for backend, React.js for the frontend. Our viewers will be able to learn new features in the Spring 5 framework, Spring MVC configuration, migrating from XML config to Java config, Spring REST API, Spring Web Flux for reactive non-blocking and asynchronous programming, consuming reactive and non-reactive APIs, Hibernate 5, Spring Security Basics and Integration, and finally React.js to create powerful front-end integrated with Spring REST, Hibernate, Security as backend. Let's talk about the roadmap of this course. We will start by introducing you to the Spring framework, what's new in Spring 5, migrating a Spring MVC XML configuration to Java configuration. We will then learn a Spring MVC building blocks and will create a Spring MVC application. We will then move on to reactive programming with the Spring 5, that is Spring WebFlux framework. Here we will learn to write reactive, asynchronous and non-blocking code using Spring WebFlux and reactive Mongo. The section 2 will detail REST protocol followed by creating and exposing REST endpoints using the Spring framework. We will then learn to create two different kind of REST clients to consume reactive and non-reactive REST APIs. The third section we will introduce you to Hibernate 5 basics. We will also learn new bootstrapping process which has been changed in Hibernate 5 followed by creating a Spring MVC and Hibernate application. We will then move on to learn Spring Security Basics and then integrate our Spring Hibernate application with Spring Security. The fourth section will introduce you to React.js. This section will cover all basics of React.js and we will learn how to create powerful web UI using React. This section will also cover basics of React routers. The last section of this course, we will start this section by creating single page application in React.js using React router. We will then learn how to integrate and package React.js application as frontend and React REST as backend, followed by integrating Spring Security to this application. This will secure the UI and as well as the REST API. We won't stop here and we will start writing security test cases for, app for our application. In the end of this section, we will introduce you to Spring Data REST and learn how to leverage Spring Data REST hypermedia information using React.js. The prerequisite for this course is to have the basic understanding of creating Java web application and very basic knowledge of the Spring framework will suffice. Alright, now let's roll up our sleeves and get started with the course in the next video. Thank you.